Hello guys and welcome back to my channel and people who don't know it's Alekia and there is Tarak behind the camera. So there is another video which I am doing a fun challenge video because uh, last videos we got a lot of love on that. So I thought let me do such kind of videos which are interesting which I can have fun and you can also have fun while watching. So I have 200 rupees. Uh, I'm going to stay the whole day with this 200. I mean not stay with this 200. So I'm going to spend 200 rupees like on all my meals like from breakfast to dinner. So I just have 200. Now you might have a doubt like why only 200? Because I had this challenge with Tarak. Like he tells me that I spend a lot of money. I waste money on food and a lot of things. So I thought I'll do it with 200. So you will be you know watching a lot more videos in future like I might do 2000 I might do 5000 but let me start with this 200 a budget uh, video so it's 10 o'clock and breakfast time so I might have uh, idli dosa whatever you know in this 200 so I have to spend wisely and uh, yeah that's uh, pretty much about my challenge so let's go from here and have some breakfast and just keep following me So I got this breakfast for like 15 rupees. So ideally, 4 idlis is for 30 rupees. And I asked them 2 idlis because they can have only 2 idlis. Even though it's for real, I can have only 2 idlis. So yeah, I took some red chutney and uh, I think that's uh, tomato chutney. Let me taste. So I'm having different this place like hot pot. This is for like first time and the chicken is good. I just checked the fresh juice ka menu and it's like expensive. It's not in my budget so I'll go with tea. I got this tea for 10 rupees. So this is a regular chai, uh, which is 10. And there are a lot of varieties and it's like 15, 20, 25. But I took this regular. And this place is like Haruku Chai Coffee House. I think this is for the first time in this place. So let me taste. I'm done with my chai. So breakfast chai I mean, costed me like 25 rupees with this chai and uh, the three two days. So I'm full. So I left with 175, which is like I'm rich. So I can spend a lot in my lunch. Ah, yeah, that's about this breakfast. So let's go for lunch. And let's see you there. Ah, it's lunch time, 12:30. 
so by the time we go out it will be maybe quarter to one so right now i'm heading to a place where i usually eat it's a ocean ocean of bakes so it's kind of a bakery but they also serve fast food but i like the fast food over there it's something around like 70 to 80 the fried rice so i think that's the best for me i eat very regular because that's very near to my cult and uh, yeah that's pretty much so let's go from here Damn, I almost completed my money. It's 110. So I took this chicken shake on fried rice and uh, one thumbs up, which is 20 rupees. So it costed me 110 finally. And I'm left out with like 65 rupees and I have to have snacks and dinner. It's possible dessert. So let's see. I got my food, so it's chicken chase one fried rice and I got this drink as well. So let me have, so this is my regular place, I know the taste, I'm pretty sure that this will be good. It's good, actually this is, this will be heavy for me because uh, ideally Tarek and me would share this with some starter. So I'll see if I can eat it or not, or else I, I'll do some parcel. Uh, I'm back from my lunch. It's actually heavy. Uh, because as I told we both used to eat that but I just had it and I made sure that I'm full but I can't even walk properly it's that heavy so see I just came to my community back it's actually a good community but I never used it I mean like gym or anything only the swimming pool I used it so yeah I have to explore this community as well but yeah coming to my food it's really nice actually so initially I thought uh, it is fun but I'm actually liking it because back then when we were studying uh, when we were in BTEC I did my BTEC so then uh, my mom used to give me like what 50 rupees per day or maybe less uh, sometimes 10 rupees 20 rupees we used to you know save all that money and eat uh, so that's the best thing about those days but right now even me some you know some of the days I just spend money like that you know just paying 300 for coffee and all so that's another part of the story but you know spending 200 for whole day I feel good like I'm just using the money very wisely uh, yeah that's the thing I'm enjoying I'm just getting back to my old days like how we used to save money we you know we used to bunk college save money and then you know uh, go eat some street food and all so yeah I'm actually liking this that's pretty much about my lunch uh, I'll just go take rest my baby is this <laughs> hi hi baby Bye! <laughs> so he just woke up so I made him sleep and I went out had lunch. By the time I came he woke up so I have to read something to him. So yeah, I'll go up, I'll take some rest and then um, we'll go out for snack maybe around like 5.30 uh, or 6 o'clock I'm not sure. So let me go and take care of myself. Bye! Hey, 
Okay, guys, I just came to this place, ideal uh, street food. Uh, so there are a lot of counters over there, and this is a place where they sit and have food. So it's evening, and I have, you know, I have sixty-five rupees, so I have to eat some snacks. So I eat light because my lunch is too heavy. So I still have that in my, you know, till here. So I leave, I leave very light, like maybe samosa or chaat. If it comes within twenty rupees, because I have to have dinner also. So yeah, let's see. I'll show you the place around. Uh, yeah, and there is a separate video which will come uh, only on this ideal street food that will be done by Tarak. So I'm not gonna show everything. So I'll show what I eat. And now let's go and. Explore. Okay, guys, I'm gonna have pani puri. It is twenty rupees. So I have seen lot of stalls, but there is nothing under sixty five. So I think this is the best option and safe option. So let me have pani puri. I have no clue how this tastes. So let's see. Come. Like that. Yeah. This is my last puri. So I got eight puris for twenty rupees, and the taste is actually good. Let me have this. What is masala? Actually, asked him. <laughs> With my pani puri and uh, yeah, I I think I'm left with 45 rupees. So I still have dinner. So if I finish the dinner within 30 rupees, then I'll have ice cream. Right. So let's see. So I might not have it here because I'm full actually. So let's see how the plan goes, and uh, I'll take you with me to the. So I'm done with the forty rupees. I'm having the winter pongal. I'll be left with five rupees more. I'll see if I can find any ice cream or not. Finally, I got this all pot pongalani. He just gave me, so let me have this. And this for forty rupees. I am still left with five rupees, but I think I do. I will not get anything with that five rupees. So, but still, I'll try. So I thought I'll move from this place, but I stayed because Tarak is doing another video. So I didn't go anywhere. I'm in this place, ideal street food. Then I'm having this chicken. So I wanted to go very light, but still they gave me nine pungalalu. I don't know if I can eat this or not. So let me enjoy my final meal of the day, and I successfully completed 200 rupees, and I sur survived. So I hope you guys like this video. So if you want some kind of videos like you know a luxury day or something like that, some fun videos, just let me know in the comments. I'll make that happen. And uh, yeah, I'm so happy that I did within 200. So I just felt, as I told you, I just felt like college days where we save money and you know eat all this kind of stuff rather than spending lavishly. This is one kind of a day. I really enjoyed. Uh, had fun. I hope you guys will have fun too. So let me hop in and then I'll have my food. Until then, I'll take you from Tarun Stories. Bye bye.